doctors in Poland say they have fears too. If they decide that an abortion is necessary to save the life of a mother, they worry that they could be investigated and face prosecution. But Lempart says she doesn't have much sympathy for the medical professionals. I don't care what their explanation is. I don't care. Women die. Not even one Polish doctor was actually charged and put in jail for providing abortion in the last 30 years. That's a lie. If they say that they're afraid of the prosecutor and the police, that's a lie. They're afraid for their careers and their money. Lempar says she's facing numerous charges herself for organizing street protests. But she says she will not be silenced. Back in Kielce, Claudia Kuszczuk tells me a month after visiting the hospital, Polish police came looking for her. They said they wanted to know what had happened at the hospital. But when Kuzdub agreed to speak with them, she says, it was a different story. They were asking me only who gave me pills and who knew about the abortion. That's all. They didn't ask me about the situation in the hospital at all. Kuzdub says she doesn't know what might come of that police investigation. But she plans on leaving Poland soon and moving to Italy. It's a Catholic country, she says. But in Italy, they don't terrorize you for terminating a pregnancy. For the world, 